Hey everyone, so I know I haven't been doing any videos lately and sorry about the noise in the background. They're doing construction right across the street from where I live. So if it like noise comes on and off, I'm so sorry. I'm trying to talk over it. So today is going to be an update and a favorites video of things I've been loving just all together. And I'm sorry I haven't been making videos um, like from December because first of all I went home for the holidays of course I wanted to spend time with my family since I hardly see them and like I've been busy doing that hanging out with my cousins hanging out with my parents my siblings and when I got back school started so like I was working, I was going to school, and I've been just really busy. Now it's about two weeks into school, going on three weeks, so I'm starting to get the hang of it, and I'm trying to make time to do videos for you guys, because I know you guys um, want to see more videos, and I'm trying to do my... Um, like my life videos because I know you guys like that too but like usually I'm at home doing homework not really doing anything so when I do something exciting I promise I'll put it up I had some clips of my niece of her singing she's the cutest I know you guys love her too but um, my phone broke so I'm actually waiting in to get a new one I'm gonna get the iPhone and so I'm waiting for that to come in so maybe like after that because I'm going home in February also I can tape when I'm there so on to my favorites before this video gets way too long I am really loving my macadamia natural oil and this is the deep repair mask it's probably backwards but so this is what it looks like. I used quite a bit of it already. As you can see, I made a dent in it. And I love the smell of this. So it's a deep repair mask. I know a lot of you know about this. But um, you first you shampoo your hair. And then you put this in. You leave it in for seven minutes. And let it like penetrate to your hair. And my hair became so soft and shiny after I use this product like my hair was so dead from all the color treatment I've done to it and after I use this it's like back to normal I love this stuff I use it about twice a week like once to twice a week it depends the next thing I've been loving since we're on the care side so this is hair care skin care I'm loving my Clarisonic this is the plus and I had the meal, I gave it to my mom. And I did get this as gratis from work. So um, I'm not sponsored to like say good things about it or whatnot. But I honestly do love this product. So um, it comes with a sensitive brush head. It has three speeds. So you turn it on. I don't think you can see it. But and then you can like raise the speed and or lower it and um yeah this has a timer so 20 20 10 10 not going into detail about it if you have one or if you don't if whatever um if you want me to do a review i'm sorry i accidentally spilled stuff but if you want me to do a review on this, I can also do a review. Okay. Next, um, like I, what I use with this is my Philosophy Purity Face Cleanser. I love this stuff. Like sometimes I don't even use my Clarisonic with this. Like if I use my Clarisonic in the morning at night, I'll just rinse, I mean wash with this and this really does amazing stuff next is my Lancome Tonique Comfort and this is a moisturizing toner it's 
more for dry skin and I have really dry skin so that's why I use this but I love this like it takes off all the excess dirt and whatever from my face if I have just washed it with the purity and without my Clarisonic because if I use my Clarisonic usually I don't have that much excess dirt left on my skin but when I just do manual cleansing I usually do so this takes it right off it works great Okay, the next thing I've been loving is my Winter Candy Apple Hand Sanitizer. Look, I'm out. I need to go back to Bath & Body and get more of these because I know they're on sale. Or I hope they still are. I hope they still have it. But I love this scent. It's my favorite, favorite, favorite scent. Okay. Next is my... Kiehl's Moisturizer. It's the Ultra Facial Cream. I love this stuff. Like it's not too heavy. It's really light and it doesn't have a scent to it and my skin just soaks this stuff right up and it feels so good. It stays moisturized throughout the whole day. I don't get any patchy or I mean patchy dry patches on my skin which I usually did when I used my Clinique one. But after I use this, oh, I love this stuff. As you can tell, look, I made a big hole in it already. And I just got this around October. But I love this stuff. Next is my Lip Fusion. Um, this one is in Berry. I have one also in Siren. But this is the Lip Fusion Lip Balm and this stuff works great. Like I used to use my EOS before and then I used this and I was like, oh my god, I love this stuff. Keeps my lips hydrated throughout the whole day and when I go back to my EOS, like the texture and the way it feels doesn't feel the same. And I always have to go back and grab this. So when I run out, I don't know what I'm going to do because this was on sale. I only got it for like $5 at Macy's. And if I have to buy it, original price $29.00. I might just even do it, but I love this stuff. Um, next is my MAC Studio Moisture Tint SPF 15. And this one is in medium dark. Um, I love this tinted moisturizer. It just gives me like even coverage all over my face. Like I don't need too much coverage I just need to even out like my skin tone and this does the job and it's light and it just sinks into my skin and I love this stuff uh, the next thing is my Stila eyeliner and this is the smudge stick waterproof eyeliner in stingray and I love this I'm using it right now like I used to use the Urban Decay 24 Glide and that used to run on me and it used to come out so easily but this one doesn't. It lasts me almost all day because I tear a lot so usually the outer corners come out but that's all I experience but I love this eyeliner. The next thing is of course my Urban Decay Primer Potion. If you guys have been watching my tutorials you know that I usually use Too Faced and when I went back to Urban Decay I rediscovered why I love this so much. I don't know why but I think it just works better than my Too Faced but I love this. The next thing is my L'Oreal Infallible in Crimson number 310. That's what I'm wearing right now. And I love this like it stays on like you can like kiss yourself and like like you know it doesn't come off whatsoever you can even like rub it like I'm rubbing it and look it doesn't come out and I just love this and my boyfriend loves it because like when I kiss him it doesn't call, go all over him and whatnot so I love this and it was on sale that's why I got this I do have other colors but I wanted to try a red because you know how if red lipstick gets all over you like it looks so messy and like it comes 
there's no sense of wearing red lips if it's just gonna come off so that's why I invested in a red one and I love this so I might get like more shades of red maybe a brighter red I know I match with darker but I might even get a brighter one but love this <clears throat> Next are my Hello Kitty glasses. I know I featured this in a, another favorites video, but I love these glasses. Like, they're just too cute. Like, I am obsessed with Hello Kitty, so if anybody has anything to say about it, then oh well. And then next are my earphones. My Hello, Hello Kitty, of course. My Hello Kitty earphones. I love this. I only got it for $8 from Walmart, but yeah. But that's the end of my update slash favorites video and I hope you guys enjoy this. I'll try to make more videos um, and try to update this channel as much as possible. But thank you guys for watching. Until next time. Bye.